garbage. Oh, man. Okay, we're into the fun part of the show now. Okay. None of that was fun. Uh, uh, all right. Yeah. Now it's fun time. You won't believe this hungover Toronto woman's McDonald's delivery order. You won't believe it, Will. Yeah, well, I Listen, listen, it. listen, listen up. Yeah. Here's the order. To cure the hangover, needs a burger. One hamburger. No regular bun. No mustard. No onion. No pickles. No patty. <laughs> Do you know what's left over, Will? Well, just the ketchup, right? Just ketchup! <laughs> they delivered. They did the delivery. It's two packets of ketchup. Mm. Because this person was so used to clicking no for everything that they actually clicked no unintentionally on the patty and the bun. They wanted a hamburger with just ketchup. Oh. But they were hung over, not thinking straight, clicked no across the board except for ketchup. And it was fulfilled. <laughs> and it was fulfilled. Yeah. And they got two packets of ketchup when they were ex expecting a hamburger. And it happened here in Toronto. Can you imagine that, mm -hmm. Will? Well, I mean. How upset would you be? You thought you had a burger and then you have two packets yeah. of ketchup that show up? I mean, that is, that's pretty rude. Yeah. Uninstall. However, shout out to the customization level on the order. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, 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 no. Add. What do you what uh, what would your hamburger have on it, Will? Uh, three patties. <laughs> three? <laughs> yeah, why not? Wow. I mean, it would the opposite I of guess. her no patty. Yeah, and just yeah, I like a now. Good, uh, let me ask hamburger. you something. Let me ask you something. Uh. If you are working at McDonald's and you get this order, yeah, is it rude to fulfill it? Uh, Should you not assume that it's wrong? Uh, the person paid for a hamburger and got two ketchup packets. Hmm. It was probably wrong or a big troll. Mm. Like they're just messing and see what they can get. You know, Interesting. Get away with. Interesting. Yeah. I don't know what the protocol is for the delivery service. If there is a screw up who calls who and who does what. So for me, it's interesting the fact that it was fulfilled. I agree with you. If it's a troll, fine. Here you go. Here's your ketchup. But since we know it's not a troll, what should the protocol be here if someone orders this? Do you really think anybody... Is it possible that somebody... That this is their order? Uh, hmm. It's hard to say because you would think be, even beforehand, the designers of the app would kind of understand like you can't really do this interesting so you, so you would depend on the designer at the, least i i do the uh, of the app the software developer yeah because so, i was a ux designer and you would have well like, easy scenarios easy holy <laughs> yeah, moly well, you know you were UX. A <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but oftentimes they would have like these uh that's called flexing use well. cases that was flexing. Well, I mean, I wouldn't say that, but... That's what the people, that's what the kids yeah. say. Okay, so you wouldn't allow somebody to say no to this configuration of goods. Like, yeah. what What would they need to have one of? A bun or a patty for it to be a burger? Yeah. yeah. What? One? Which one? Bun or the patty? Yes. I would say the patty is more important. But what if a person wants a bun with... Mustard, onion, pickles, ketchup. Well, it wouldn't be like a hamburger. It would be a separate uh, item. It wouldn't say hamburger. It would say like miscellaneous menu or something that they can order that kind of stuff. Okay. Yeah. So the patty is non-negotiable. You shouldn't be able to have no patty. Yeah. I think that's the most important item in a hamburger. Cool. If you order a hamburger. Interesting. So this order... Could have been a patty and two ketchup packets, and you'd be okay with that. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. I, I think I, I think I agree with yeah, you. I think we just yeah. fixed it. Okay. You shouldn't be able to extract the patty from a burger. Maybe someone's going to disagree with us in some circumstance. I bet you there's people out there that order a Big Mac, no beef. Yeah. They <laughs> <It's> just three. 
three slices of bread? I'm saying it's been done. I'm just saying it's hey, probably. Oh, yeah. I do have a story. I ordered a hamburger without the patty ones. <laughs> this um, is you. But I, I went in to order. I was like, hey, you know, I have like a burger cooking in the grill at my place. I just need some buns. Oh, you actually wanted it. Yeah. And it was like I couldn't go to the store because like I have to buy like an eight pack or something. This so is I had insane. To get, like, this is insane. Buns. So I went to McDonald's to get just two buns. That is the you put your Why own. Is that ridiculous? You put your own beef on McDonald's buns. I did because I didn't want to buy an eight pack at the superstore. This is incredible. Well, you know, I love this story. And then they they were just like they charged me a regular hamburger, right? And uh, without the patty. So you uh, only got the bun. Uh, were there any yeah, other? Yeah, they asked for something like other stuff. You like had no other toppings. And yeah, I was like, no, just give me the buns. Just the buns. Uh, this is uh, wow. Riveting. Yes. I don't think that gets done that often, man. You, no, it's it's probably not done very often. No, and, and and I wonder if it's offensive. You're like, oh, no, I'll be adding the beef to that. Thank you very they much. slap a patty at me. <laughs> yeah. I'd oh. like to add my own beef. It's cooking at home. Yeah. Give me the bun. I came for the bun. Wow, it's incredible. 